Ooh. You making the world tingle. Look at that. It's a man alien, and he's young. I usually get old lady aliens. Hello. Hello? You know, you kind of fine for an extraterrestrial. Oh, I'll dispel the rumors with him so he's not all like, oh, you know, you're a horrible person. I heard about you. Did this alien come here because he know I'm a hoe from another dimension? And he's like, the, the word is that you're a whore throughout all the galaxies. And that's why I came here to find you and see for myself. So I can get some space booty. <laughs> that's cool with me. I want to get some space booty. Ow. Wow, he got that weird voice. I don't like that. Yeah, the alien is single. Okay. Well, that's good. That's good to know. He don't got some space hoe waiting for him back at home. You a sexy alien. Oh, we compatible. He a Pisces. I'm a Pisces in real life. So, that's cool. Missy, go on about your business. I'm going to get some space booty. You know you like that, Mr. Alien. Oh, he, oh, he didn't like that. I thought we was connecting on an interpersonal relationship level. See, he, he seemed like he's liking it now. See, now I'm afraid to kiss him again, though. Because I thought everything was good. We was having a good time. He was liking what I had to say. And then all of a sudden, he's like, oh, no, you whore. Stop. Don't kiss me like that. We we kiss some weird alien way or something. Uh, she's saying he fit. He buff under that suit. He do look like he got a body on the suit. No, where you going, alien? Come back. No. No, alien, 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 alien. Oh, we got mail. Might as well go check the mail. Wait a minute. The inter... Wait, seriously, the intergalactic lover has a bicycle? Are you for real? Okay, got things in the mail. Nothing great. But let's see. Oh, we got a table. That's cool. Got umbrella. Oh, we always keep that umbrella. Got a laptop. We sell that laptop, though. That was nice of whoever sent it. Thank you. Oh, yeah. We ain't doing that streaking thing. I don't care about streaking. Can we call? Oh, it's like 5 o'clock in the morning. We can't call that alien. Even from space, that's rude. LaDonna, take your ass to bed. Seriously, girl. Misty, we're Misty. Ew, signs burping all gross. Well, Missy did want to fix that toilet, so she might as well. Like, I swear to God, these girls are on, like, some, like, you know, like, they acting like they have no freedoms. They're not prisoners in this house. Seriously, have you guys really just sat in this basement the whole time? I guess they really have nothing to do. But I have story progression on, so, like, what's going on? Why are nobody moving? Everybody take your booties to bed. Okay, so it's morning now, and I think it's an appropriate time to call that alien. Because uh, I'm interested in him now. Um, LaDon's never been with an alien. Then again, LaDon's never been with a plant sim either. But still, we, uh, we want him there. So let's invite him out. Let's invite the alien over. Uh, he's coming, yes. Um, what is his name? Quill Sul? I, I don't know. I really don't know. It can't be Quell. There's no I in there. I don't know what his name is. I'm not even going to attempt it. What is all that? Oh, they're like bees? What the fuck? Why do we have a bee infestation? Is this new? Did this come on like Island Paradise? I don't like this. I don't like bees. I'm allergic to bees. I don't like bees. Move, mailman. I'm waiting for my alien. And while the alien takes forever, I gotta check the mail. That's right. I know you're gonna move on my way. Don't take pictures of my bare booty. Maybe I should put on clothes for it when the alien comes. Um, change into everyday one. I have two everyday outfits. Seriously, no, I don't. Don only has one outfit because she looks too good in it to ever change. Oh, he's here. Where is he? Oh, he's behind the sign. You are such a good little hider. You're all green and stuff, blending in with the foliage. And he just not getting his text. Stop singing, LaDonna.
But if I had heard his voice, I would have known who he was, but he wasn't talking. Oh my god, Legion's tan has worn off. <gasps> so has Misty's. <gasps> oh, phone. No, no. Phone, hold on. You will ruin this for me. She's winking at the alien. He's loving it. She's like, you know it. LaDonna's charms cannot be resisted by anyone. Any man on any planet of any species. They all love LaDonna. I'm not giving that alien no flowers. He probably wouldn't even know what to do with them. He'd probably eat them. Aliens are notoriously stupid for very smart people. Like, like th seriously though, aliens are stupid for being such like intelligent like beings. They're really stupid. Like, think about it. Like the movie Signs and like the cornfield with like that racist Mel Gibson. Well, like, remember like oh they can travel to through time but they can't open the door. Seriously. And they come to a planet that, like, I don't know, like, 90-something percent is, like, water. Or is that the human body? 90% is... 90% of the human body is water. 70% of the planet is water. Something like that. But, like, yeah, your your one weakness is water, so you come to the planet full of water. You should have stayed on the fucking moon. I know you love me, though, alien. Because you really are just stupid, even though you think you're smart. And then I'm starting to burn in the sun. We may have to take this inside. Time to woohoo. Oh, LaDonna. She's being very forceful because she's burning. She's like, you got me on fire, baby. No, that's the UV rays from the sun. Oh, LaDonna just skipped off. Follow me. Follow me. Wait, is he not going to come because I didn't invite him inside technically? I probably didn't invite him inside, so he's not gonna come and do me. Invite inside. Jeez. This game is so stupid. If, I, if I'm inviting you to come inside of my vagina, you should come inside my house. That was, like, really dirty. I'm sorry. <laughs> it's true, though. Like, I'm offering to sleep with you, and you don't understand that that means come inside of my house. Get in here. Get in this hot tub with me. Take off your suit. I want to see how built your body is. There's like bees inside the house and butterflies. The butterflies are supposed to be there, not the bees. Cosmic girl. What? Um, LaDonna Alamode is doing poorly at university and is in danger of losing their scholarship if she doesn't improve her academic performance. What? I'll lose my scholarship? What? Does that mean I have to pay for classes? Oh, hell no. Hell no. Oh, he is kind of built. What well, his? Okay, his hand doing something weird right there. Like he want to jerk off or something. His body doesn't look too bad though. Okay, he knows. He knows what what time it is. Yeah. Yeah, it says failing university. Yeah, I do want to kiss you in this hot tub. Yeah, sure, whatever. Yeah. <laughs> Ow, making that foot wiggle. <laughs> Aw. You know what? LaDonna and this green guy are actually pretty cute looking. Like, he's actually pretty sexy. How come I can't do stuff with him now, though? Oh, I can make out. Here we go. I'm gonna say, like, where's the romantic options? It's like, there was none. What happened to, like, the old making out in the hot tub? Like, a sim would, like, straddle the other sim. Like, the sims, too, they used to get it in. I'm telling you. Like, you can't even woohoo in your car in The Sims 3 anymore. That just uh, sucks. I used to love woohooing in the car in Sims 2. Like, you couldn't get anywhere. You just woohoo in your car in front of a lot. And then your lover would come or multiple of your lovers would come. And, you know, they get mad. And then you'd be like, oops. Sorry, I didn't know you were on this lot. My bad. Ah, sometimes I miss The Sims 2. Now I want to play The Sims 2. But not today. D dang it, this phone call ruined everything. I was trying to get laid. Whoa, his like head is going... Like, he's weird. Like, his head is going through stuff. Let's find out if he's romantic at all. Oh my god, this phone. Seriously, phone, Stop. Dance at grind. 
We, we can dance at Grind. I dance with the alien at Grind. You want to go to Grind with me, alien? Well, maybe I should feed him or something first. Like, is there food in here? No, there's no food. No one could have cooked. Really? Like, serve brunch. Like, freaking Missy. What are you doing? Just getting fat on your fat ass? Damn it. Oh, she just came on the fireman's pole. She does look chunky again. I'm so hard on Misty. It's so funny. I'm so hard on Misty. I'm, I feel bad sometimes for her. But only sometimes. The other time, I just think about me. The other times, I feel fine. He is kind of muscly, though. Like, look at his pecs. He just needs abs, though. But he has muscle. He just needs to bring them to four. Are seriously, like, all you bitches dying because you don't know how to go eat? Like, you stay? Because the thing is, they do have free will. They do. But they're fucking idiots. Free will is on. Like, okay, Misty, call everyone to meal. Everyone. But you don't eat, Misty. You don't eat because you're fat. In fact, um, Misty, why don't you, like, learn how to make drinks? Like, make mommy some drinks. Practice making drinks. Oh, uh, LaDonna, you don't need to eat either. You can get blood from the fridge. I don't even care about these girls eating. See, they only came because I called them all to eat. What are they going to do after they eat? They're just going to stand there like bumps on a log. You, you have been sleeping this whole time. Paris. I don't like you, Paris. I want to drink my blood near my boyfriend. What's the dog doing? No one puts baby in a corner. Your sandwich is over there, idiot. You're not getting anything to eat, idiot. I feel bad for Margaret. Margaret's pretty. I gotta remember that name, Margaret, because uh, she'd be good for one of the, the like the King Legacy boys, the heirs, cause she's pretty. She got a nice face. She kind of looks like Mika, 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 Mika Kelly, Mika Moore, <laughs> Mandy Moore. <laughs> gimme, give gimme give more. I'm gonna embrace my alien before we go to that club, cause I want him to go to the club with me. I can't believe LaDonna is seriously going to lose, like, her scholarship. That kind of fucking sucks. Why can't she embrace him? What is he doing? Oh, my God. Stop doing dishes. I, like, I know you want to be helpful, but, like, not like that. That's Misty's job. Misty, come take care of these dishes. Oh, alien. Like, if we ever got married, I would change your name because I cannot have that attached to me. That last name is weird. Okay, so let's go to grind with the alien. And I guess Misty could come. All you dumb bitches, just because none of you hoes know how to get out and have fun. Let's all go out. Oh my god, it's like totally girls night plus one. This is gonna be fun. Let's go. Everyone ate, so none of you should start a death at the club. Besides Misty, I mean. Like, Misty might start a death at the club. And that won't be my fault, so... Come on, you guys. Let's go. Oh, my God. You are so tacky, Sarah. Ugh. Sarah, I hate you just because you look fucked up. Let's get our ass to the club, y'all. Whose car are we taking? Are we taking my car? Can we seriously all fit in my car? Are we even going to attempt this at everyone fitting in my car? Apparently, we are. Alien, where are you? Follow. Is Missy running there? Oh, she was about to. Missy... You had such a blonde moment. Okay, aliens coming. All right, let's go. Paparazzi, you weren't invited. That's why Paparazzi's leaving. She's like, well, everyone's leaving the house now. Ow, oh, girls nine, pump up the jams, y'all. Oh my god, I love girls night. Ah, oh, girls night. This is like totally cool. This is like totally like a sorority girl moment. Like, yeah. Dancing at the club with our alien boyfriend and all of our sorority sisters are here? Like, beta tau forever. Ooh, Missy can moonlight as a bartender and make some money. Because I know she's good at that. Be accused of cheating. No, alien. No. Oh, my God. And, oh, my God, my professor is here. My professor is here. No, alien. It's not what you think. It's not what you think. Be rejected. Oh, the the. The professor's breaking up with me, and the alien's breaking up with me. Oh my god, no. Listen. It doesn't count if... It, 
It's not cheating if you're in different zip codes. And we were in different galaxies. This doesn't make sense. You can't slap me. I have to get rejected by this bitch first. No. Oh my god. He's like totally neutral. He doesn't hate me. So that's good. But he's totally neutral now. He's like, I don't even know you anymore. Oh my god. Listen, professor. You are just screwing everything up for me. What's this bitch saying? Like, we can only be friends? Tear up the dance floor? Yeah, Misty. Tear up the dance floor, too. Rock and dance, Misty. That's right. She learned how to club dance in, in, in elementary school. Boarding school, basically. So, i just been rejected, and now I'm about to get slapped. You don't know me. Okay, alien? I'll slap you. I thought I was going to get slapped. I was the one... I was the offender. You offended me. I became the offender. Now listen. I'm not afraid to scare nobody. Because there is no one here I care about. And that's just being real. Okay. Misty. Misty's here. So I care about Misty. But no. Listen. You messed up. Is it dead yet? And you. You know what? Oh. He down. That's what's up. Okay, now you, ho, you, you are the reason I'm losing my scholarship. You are wrinkled up, too. Yeah, you see him? That's your fate. I shot her right in the neck. I hope it made it. Oh, there is a cop coming? But she's dying, though. Okay, then that's all that matters. Arrest me. I. That's right, I did it, and I do it again. I'm failing out of school. I was supposed to dance and have a good time with my sorority sisters. This alien just came from nowhere out of space, out of the big blue sky, and was just like, I want to rock your world. He rocked it, and then he's leaving me. Put me in the car. I don't care. Campus police. What campus police going to do? You can't hold me down. I am LaDonna Alamo. You cannot hold me down. Oh, and you glitched. Ha ha. You ain't arrest me then. I'm getting my ass back up in there. And I want to go dance. What's up? What's up? What you going to do about it? What you going to do about it? Ow. Go dancing. Go dancing. Go dancing. Ow. Stepping over your dead body. Ow. Come on, Misty. We got to show them how we do it. Oh, that bitch dead now too. Oh, she passed out. Don't act like you don't know. Ow. Can't arrest me. Can't arrest me. Oh, oh, look at me, cop. Ha ha. Can't touch this. Debbie died of hunger. That's Debbie' damn fault, then. Ow. Ow, that's right. Ooh, cop, you want to dance with me? Call over to dance. Come on, girls. Let's not let the death of all those people, like, interfere with a good time. That's right, cop. You know what you're doing. Let's go. Yeah, stop hanging over there by the dead body. Come here and have some fun. Ow. Woo. Ow. This is how you have a good time after someone dies. Woo. See, now I know I like these girls. When you murder two people right in front of everyone and your girl stands by you, that's when you know you truly are sisters for life. I love sororities. Ah, uh, we gotta dance for two more hours. Keep going. Girl, you ain't got no shoes. That is ghetto as hell. You go to the club and you take off your heels so you can dance. You know what? I ain't even mad at you, girl. Keep it going. <laughs> Only one more hour left, and I think the club closes at four, so we have some time. Uh oh, Misty! I see you, Misty. Oh, girl. Car still parked outside. <laughs> oh, hey, ah, uh, ah, uh, hey, ah, uh, oh, oh, hey, hey, ow. Best night ever. Yep, and LaDonna got her three hours. Now, we better head home because uh, we have class in the morning, and apparently, um, LaDonna ain't doing so good. Oh, LaDonna don't have anything. Anything. Oh, you see that tiny bit of red? That's her grade. Shit. Well, 
It don't matter the club is closed. It's time to go home. Thank you, cop. We had a blasty blast. Uh, I want to take a photo of him in the booth. I thought I wanted to do him in the booth. Where, Misty, Misty, where you at, girl? It's time for you to come home, too. Okay, back home. Get your booties in bed. Your final semester of college begins in the morning.